tabarire eno ni ya kwirorero ni mudu wothe so hey sasa tuko hapa mm-hmm. uh, tu, okay sasa sisi familia yetu tume mm-hmm. grow up kama watoto wenye ni kama mkokwa in an urban society but mm. mleshi ushago so yeah. lifestyle yetu haijakuwa more of mm. a village kind of lifestyle mm-hmm. but imekuwa more of the urban kind of setup mm-hmm. so nime grow up kwa family yenye ni ya dancers kuna watu hawajui HPMC ni nini HPMC yeah. ni ule mtu mwenye analeta anga dance energy mm-hmm. fun kwa 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 event kwa event yeah. eh Hey, sasa mimi niko zile za eh hype DJ man. Mm-hmm. Are you sure? Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Akana mwe shika mic na akasema so oh, hey, guys mm-hmm. get ready. Yeah. Eh hey, kilo nini? Eh hey, watu huko chini kina dere kuna kijana mwe anaitwa Dere. Dere mm-hmm. wako. Hey. Mm-hmm. We, we nilishika hiyo mic lakini kwa sikia kaanza anguka chini. Mm-hmm. Well, wa baba funny enough mm-hmm. the men ndo waliingia ku, ku support mm-hmm. the ladies walikuwa zile za yo kwanza hiyo ngo umevaa siste no mm-hmm. alafu mimi unaruka ruka <laughs> my dear no the men mm-hmm. especially waliingia na tuka hype tuka hype yeah. nikamwambia soche ni hype mhm akanambia eh, unaona kama ni vizuri kweli ukiwa yeah, because yeah. it's your wedding eh. yeah achukue mic asichukue mic achukue obviously mm-hmm. watu wenye wako hapa wenye wamesimamia harusi yeah. ni nani ni brother zangu watasema nini yeah, yeah. 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 Nikachukua mic ilikuwa a very tough decision for me. Mm-hmm. So with time niki grow up mm-hmm. with time don't nimekuja mm-hmm. nikiona I can still do it. Yeah. I can still go for auditions without the tabanju. Hata nikifika hapo na kitambaa obviously nita see at the auditions na nikaambua we know you are a good actor but oh, character hauko uh, hatuna hiyo. Jo kwa mind yao nikitokea na kitambaa obviously I want to expect nitatoa nani at expect tutatoa. Hi everyone and welcome back to the Pulse Panel. Today we are hosting a very talented woman. But before we start our conversation today, I'd like to remind you that this episode has been sponsored by Cool Palace Airbnbs. Um they have apartments along Kiambu Road in Thika Road at Roisambu, in Sosiani Estate and in Ruaka. Um they have a part, they have studio apartments, one bedroom apartments and two bedroom apartments. You can visit them at their offices. They are located at Mozaiga Square, first floor, wing C. And just a little introduction before I let my guest introduce herself. Um she's a radio host. Um she's a hype master. Sit I say my mistress because she's really a hype master. What can I tell you? female no being a mistress I'm like a hype man she's truly a hype master she's also an event host and a content creator and an actor mhm unaweza to introduce na usiwaambie pia jina ya usani hi guys mm. yes thank you so much You're for welcome. bringing me into the studio today mm-hmm. uh, i am called lilo karema that is mm-hmm. what people know me for yeah. uh, that is my stage name karema mm-hmm. Yeah, but uh, majina ya ID mm-hmm. ni Lili Kemenia. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And um I'm a mother of two and um a sibling, third born in a family of five. Mm-hmm. And uh just as you said, I'm a content creator, a radio host, an MC and also an actor. Yes. Mm-hmm. So maybe just you can give us a little bit of your background, uh, where you went to school, where you were born ulisomea wapi and everything for once a kazi sasa okay tuanze from the the one si ndio mm-hmm. so yes yeah so um i was born in luakabete mm-hmm. uh, born and raised in luakabete mm-hmm. kumekuwa na transitions in between mm-hmm. but uh, majorly tume nimegrow up luakabete mm-hmm. uh, born at a um, uh, place in it wa ngorokori mm-hmm. and so i grew up in a family of five kids I'm the third born mm-hmm. and a family of akurinos. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So ukiniona na kitambaa si ati nimeivalia ati hapa mm-hmm. juzi juzi yeah. ati imekujia kuvaliwa ati venye nime grow up no mm-hmm. I was born and raised in an akurino family mm-hmm. my father and mother being akurino. Mm-hmm. And I went to school in I started off my primary school. Okay tunaanza na primary juu nursery really. Mm-hmm. Yeah. so mm-hmm. acha to delve to tuingie tu kwa primary yeah. so i went to a school called parklands primary school mm-hmm. up until class 6 and then i transferred to a school called Ndurarwa mm-hmm. so tumetoka parklands Ndurarwa in satellite no so, kuna hiyo Ndurarwa ya satellite na ah. kuna nyingine iko Kingero eh okay <laughs> eh kuna Ndurarwa ya Kingero yeah. uh-huh. so yeah tukatuka transfer to mm-hmm. Ndurarwa mm-hmm. 
and after that now after clearing Durarua I went to uh, Kiriti Girls mm -hmm. in Moranga okay. that is where I did my high school and then I cleared high school Nikangoja Kidogo joined campus mm -hmm. at Moi University did my diploma and then I cleared my diploma and joined St. Paul's uh, where I did my degree okay yes the, um, I think I met you in where is on my 2013-2012 because back then you were dancing because I remember me like I dance like in a group in PCG because me and like meet in PCG like I would come once in a while to see my aunt and then I met you come um only transition Ajay from now the dancing to mm -hmm. know you are hyping at events so hey sasa tuko hapa to okay sasa sisi familia yetu to me grow up kama watoto wenye ni kama mko kwa in an urban society but mm. you shall go so yeah. lifestyle yetu haijakuwa more of mm -hmm. a village kind of lifestyle mm -hmm. but imekuwa more of the urban kind of setup mm -hmm. so nime grow up kwa family yenye ni dancers mm -hmm. and kwa hiyo family yenye ni dancers tulikuwa na group if mm -hmm. kanisani mm -hmm. but haikuwa si ati ilikuwa so much supported <laughs> na church <laughs> but <laughs> <laughs> but tulikuwa tu tuna dance yeah. so nilikuwa na tulikuwa na dance na um, my brothers and uh, some few friends mm -hmm. two guys mm -hmm. and nilianza hivyo kama dancer so yeah. in the midst of kukua dancer there was mm -hmm. a, a, a particular day two guys in my life have mm -hmm. uh, wamechangia from ku transition kwangu kutoka kwa ku dance yeah. to now like starting ku hype MC mm -hmm. Well, mm. kuna watu hawajui PMC ni nini? Hai PMC yeah. ni ule mtu mwenye analeta dance, energy, mm. fun kwa 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 well, event. Yeah. Eh, so eh kuliko event nyingine ya Dan Rose, mm. he's an Akorino DJ. Mm -hmm. Eh anaitwa Dan Rose Marinke. Tuliko event yake alikuwa na ana celebrate kwa sababu ya ku alikuwa amefanya DJing so alikuwa ana celebrate. Yeah. So during that event mm -hmm. kulikuwa na kuna MC mwingine anaitangwa Hype D. Mm -hmm. Hype D akaniambia lilo mm -hmm. shika maiko hype watu. Mhm. Mm eh, hey, mimi niko zile za. Ilikuwa event kubwa ile kwa sisi wengi. Eh, ilikuwa na watu wengi. Ah. Ilikuwa ni unajua events za Corino zi kuja watu wengi. Yeah, Ndio ilikuwa na event ya Corino. <laughs> <laughs> But ilikuwa pia imekuja yeah. na watu wengi. Yeah. Ndio alikuwa anafanya alikuwa anafanya DJ classes pale kubamba. Mhm. Mm Hey, sasa mimi niko zile za eh hype DJ man. Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Akana mweshi kama na akasema so hey, guys get yeah, ready. Eh yeah. hey, kilo nini? Eh hey, watu huko chini kina direct kuna kijana mwingine anaitwa direct. Dede mm -hmm. wako eh. Hey. Mm -hmm. We, we nilishika hiyo mic lakini ngoa sikia kaanza anguka chini. So nikaanza ku hype up. Yeah. And the reception I got mm -hmm. I think ndo ili ni pair ili ni encourage. I didn't like After that I didn't start off immediately yeah. but it gave me iyo motisha ya you can do this. You can do it, yeah. And then there was this other time tulikuwa tumeenda event na brother yangu na sister yangu. Sister so sisi tulikuwa tunaimba pia. I was in a group yeah, ya kuimba. Yeah. Eh, so yeah. tulikuwa tunaimanga kama ka group pia. Mm -hmm. So tulikuwa tumeitwa twende to perform mahali kwa mm -hmm. shule and um sasa tumeenda na brother zangu nikamwambia nika brother zangu sacha ni hype watu hiyo ni mimi nilikuwa tuna yeah sacha ni hype watu brother mwana ambaye utaweza ngambe utaweza acha ni hype acha ni hype acha ni hype so ngachukua mic nikaanza eh unafanya hata vitu wote uelewi ni unafanya but you just do it so from there from the reception i got mm -hmm. and from the support i get i got from the people behind me really ni pay your courage ya ku start off Okay and what was like your first event in Ulilipwa kwenda ku hype watu and eh, what was the experience like my first one can i recall mm -hmm. hmm naweza kumbuka event yenye nililipwa I'm only volunteer mara ya kwanza <laughs> we mingi ni volunteer oh wale oh, like, eh. mm -hmm. what i think this one was the first one mm -hmm. if i am not wrong this one mm -hmm. was the first ilikuwa ni harusi mm -hmm. So, eh Kare akani call. Kare is a makeup artist. Mm -hmm. Ana yeah, 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 very yeah, famous yeah, makeup yes. artist. Yes. Eh so ya Kare ni rafiki yangu and alikuwa anajua anafanya ngai hizi vitu. Mm -hmm. So brother yake alikuwa anafanya harusi. Mm -hmm. Akaniambia Lilo, eh mm -hmm. nataka kukupea harusi ukuje tu haipi. Yeah. And yeah, akanilipa. So mimi nikaenda. Actually at that particular time mm -hmm. 
siko sure kan kwamba fanya zingine but i think alikuwa ameniona kwa vitu zingine zingine but this yeah. one is the one that i can recall vizuri mm-hmm. i was pregnant hiyo time no, I did, I no, I like no, I it was very small hata haunge tena ah, not unless uangalie vizuri ndo ungejua yeah. so nikaenda nika hype eh nika hype nika hype no jo nika wakorino ujo kwa wakorino I was about to ask the person in Corino pia the one who was getting married he's a Corino ah, both okay. the guy and the lady, and the lady. Mm-hmm. ni brothers brother yake mm-hmm. na sasa sasa wewe fake and nilishukuru Mungu juu them wali accept ni nene hebu okay mm-hmm. kwa Corino that's a very foreign concept it yeah. was a foreign mm-hmm. thing especially being a lady mm-hmm. unajua kwa chali i think kwa Corino mi nikaulizwa afadhali kwa kijana ukiwa mkorino kuliko ukiwa dem ju dem dem iko tuna challenges zake mm-hmm. baya so nikaenda nika hype well wa baba funny enough mm-hmm. the men ndo waliingia ku, ku support the yeah. ladies walikuwa zile za yo kwanza hiyo ngo umevaa siste no mm-hmm. alafu wewe unaruka ruka, ruka, ruka. <laughs> my dear no na no, atasema nyingine zingine uh, ni za shetani <laughs> <laughs> yeah but uh, mm-hmm. the guys Mm-hmm. wali wali the men mm-hmm. especially wali yeah. ingia na tuka hype tuka yeah. hype the reception was okay and yeah i think it was the first time and it was a good experience and so ah but you also to digress kidogo you also hyped at your wedding <laughs> Yeah. Because yeah, because my mom was there. I remember alikuja tu akasema, "Eh, hey, lilo watu inivet here. Okay, sasa for those when you are one, but mnaelewa kikuyu watu wa each and eh. But then alikuja tu kusema when you will dance and it was you know people expect there is another MC like there is another hype person uh, and yeah. uh, uh, dance you to but then it was you. So like will you decide that like I'll do it at my wedding. <laughs> I'm really happy to. <laughs> so, okay. okay nilikuwa nikianzia ku MC mm-hmm. sikuwa na MC nikiwa peke yangu yeah. nilikuwa na MC oh my jesus but then unajo after me mention hiyo ndio nimekumbuka mm-hmm. my first gig miki hype MC ilikuwa mm-hmm. ni harusi ya mtu mwingine ah. but yeah so eh, nilikuwa nina nilikuwa nime na, nilianza na kuhype nilikuwa mm-hmm. tulikuwa tunafanya MC tukiwa wawili mm-hmm. so it, it was not just me ilikuwa mimi na hype MC and then this guy an yeah. MC so huyo chali mwenye niliita mm-hmm. ndio alikuwa na em, ndio tulikuwa tunafanya naye kazi mm-hmm. so yeah. si obviously atakuwa tu MC yeah. but um hiyo time hakuwa anajua ku hype sai he's good mm-hmm. but hiyo time yeye yeah, alikuwa ametoka kwa kufanya hizi vitu za kayamba na unajua watu mm-hmm. wa kayamba mostly hype mm-hmm. session zao zao kwa zile za Eh, yeah. hizo chini kwa chini mm. kani twisty vitu mm-hmm. kama hizo. Hakuwa na ile ku... venye okay venye naweza fanya mm-hmm. basi. Hana vimba da hana vitu zikoje. Hakuwa na hizo energy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Basi hiyo yako sawa. Mm-hmm. So um, ne, but nilikuwa nimeita vijana au kina dere ndo mm-hmm. nilikuwa nimewa invite. Yeah. I expected them ndo watakuja tufanye hiyo session mm-hmm. pamoja. Mm-hmm but wakukuja mm-hmm. waliniambia later on walipotea something something mm-hmm. so hawaku come up hawaku show up so mimi ndio huyo sasa tuko hapo tuna tuna Kayama. tuna dance <laughs> tuna yeah. dance ngoma tuna dance mm-hmm. eh nikamwambia soche ni hype mm-hmm. akanambia eh, unaona kama ni vizuri kweli ukiwa yeah, because it's your wedding eh. yeah. <laughs> and then so akasema mm-hmm. and then he's very sharp mm-hmm ndi ageje ndio mle watafanya watasema yeah. wata, wata react mm-hmm. akachukua mike akasema eh mnajua tunafanyanga kazi mm-hmm. na Karema mnajua Karema ni MC yeah achukue mike asichukue mike achukue obviously mm-hmm. watu wenye wako hapa wenye wamesimamia yeah. rusi ni nani ni brother zangu watasema nini yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. nikachukua mike mm-hmm. nika hype and i think for me yeah. it was the best decision that i made mm-hmm. because um If I would do a wedding again I'd still mm-hmm. do it cuz mm-hmm. this time bigger and better mm-hmm. due your time I was not confident enough yeah. but this time mm-hmm. hey mutasikilia uko kwa gate <laughs> so yeah. yeah so and okay so right now like if someone anataka your services mm-hmm. like do they specify we just want an, an event host like akuna hype um, um when they contract you do you come with both them it has to be specified in an event yako na ana host peke yake and then ingine maybe kutakuwa na your session it depends with the person uh-huh. kuna watu wananitanga kama MC yeah. so mtu akinita kama MC obviously uh-huh. utapata package ya yeah. hype mm-hmm. 
Juu sasa hizi MC na nisi hai. Oh yeah. Na yeah. ni harusi. Mm-hmm. But kuna watu wenye specifically they have their own MCs but mm-hmm. huyu MC hana hafanya yeah, yeah, hype MC yeah. so mm-hmm. they, they call me mm-hmm. as a hype MC. Yeah. So yeah. Mwenye ananitanga kama hype MC anapatanga mm-hmm. tu hiyo but sasa mwenye ananita kama MC fully na kuja mm-hmm. with the whole thing. With the whole thing. Yeah. Ushai kwa ina situation yenye like mimi nimekuja event yenye ume hype ume MC and everything and I have loved your work and then maybe mm-hmm. na refer to someone else but yeye hakujui ama like ile nyenye like mtu alikuwa amemblaka kwa kola kwambie we can meet and discuss ni and then when you show up akole like hey ni mkorino ni mdem we zinisa hata tu okay first they've known where ni dem from the name mm-hmm. but then anaona ah ni mkorino kuna tu washai judge like your ability to call like hey see that ni kama utaweza ama like anaku judge too from the onset they've not even seen what you can do almost o- everyone <laughs> <laughs> all yeah. all events mm-hmm. that I do mm-hmm. na getting your reception. Mm-hmm. Uh, I ha- there's this particular event that a friend of mine del kwameni she's um anafanya ngashering she has mm-hmm. an ushering company mm-hmm. and she's also uh, an event an events planner. Yeah. So alikuwa me to bring together alikuwa meet watu kadha kadha mm-hmm. watu wa kupika nini nini mm-hmm. na sasa MC. So mimi nimefika pale ana introduce kwa mwenye event mm-hmm. akasema so ya uh, eh, ka, meet Karima Karima ndiye atakuwa MC mm-hmm. eh mama aliniangalia hivi eh hey, mm-hmm. wewe we, we utatuweza kweli mm-hmm. wewe we utatuweza ilikuwa event ya yeah? ilikuwa ni birthday ya ah, sahani yake okay nikamwambia eh hey, just tulieni mm-hmm. hapo mm-hmm. tafanya event mm-hmm. and nikaenda hapo nyuma ya tent and nyuma ya tent nilikuwa tunaambia god nikaibika niona ibika because yeah. it's not about me it's mm-hmm. about you mm-hmm. so yeah most times napatanga most i think ni kama every event apart mm-hmm. from hata ya sister yangu arusi mm-hmm. ya sister yangu mm-hmm. jenili yeah. hype mm-hmm. yake siko MC ni mm-hmm. hype watu wenye crowd yenye inakuja mm-hmm. mostly wanakuanga zile za eh mkurino mm-hmm. eh mdem yeah. sana sana i think hata inakuanga mkurino mdem ya yeah. juni msichana pia wata sasa msichana tena kujanga after mm. but sir, the first thing that clicks their head mostly mm. inakonga ni mukorino yeah. so yeah, i think for me all events mm. inakonga ukutapata tu specific people wa kozile za mm. aya utaweza eh we una mc eh aje eh ebu tungoje mm. tuone Yeah. Okay, so was it like a major transition kutoka because initially you look on a hype and then now you became like an event or some which one will precede the other? Um between hosting like kama MC2 bila like maybe ku hype. Ilianzia na ku hype. Ilianza ku now to the MC. Eh. Like was it like just a smooth and honey kaingia to like just something that occurred naturally ama ama like ni mtu alikuliza now can you MC then uko na other maybe I can also start MC. Hapana mm. um Unajua kuna watu wenye tu kienda ku hype MC mm. they think you're an MC. Oh they don't know the difference. Yeah. yeah okay. So hata mm-hmm. unapatanga most times hata mm-hmm. nikienda ku hype MC na mm-hmm. watu wananitanga MC mm-hmm. MC MC mm-hmm. juu pia vile una hype MC yeah, mtu yeah. anaweza tell unaweza MC. Oh yeah you can do. Ni vile too. hauja mm-hmm. maybe pewa hiyo package ya ku MC. Mm-hmm. Yeah so for me I don't think it was really hard mm-hmm. but nilikuwa mm-hmm. na ku hype MC kwangu ni easy yeah. juni dance na ni hype na ni nini mm-hmm. nini mm-hmm. ku MC ilikuwa na attention kana kujanga hata wa leo si ati yeah. haikuwa anki mm. every, every time naitangwa ku MC mm-hmm. kuna tension mi upata ju sasa ku MC you know you're taking the whole event yeah. Yeah. from the beginning paka mm-hmm. ishe yeah. kwa MC mimi kuita hapa ni mara moja mm-hmm. as in ku dance for me ni kama tu nimelala niambia i'm going to dance i'll do it yeah. but ku MC you any it entails so many things hata mm-hmm. kuepe okay pia ku MC na entails so many things because you need to read the crowd yeah. Mm-hmm. but for me i think ku MC ku transition mm-hmm. kuingia kwa MC up until today mm-hmm. eh na kuanga na attention before ni ifanye okay so so in all this like what has been like a major highlight for you kwa mm-hmm. job yako okay utatambia like the major highlight na ile time that was challenging yeah um most chal- let me start with the challenge mm-hmm. i think the challenge has been um for me accepting mm-hmm. uh having the confidence of i can do this yeah. and bila kufikiria what will people people say okay hiyo hata ijai kwa major issue mm-hmm. but me for me ni kugather hiyo confidence yeah. yeah 
hii ninafanya mm-hmm. and i can do it and unajua most times unapatanga i think ndo gain confidence mm-hmm. ni venye watu wanakwambia eh manze lilo we ni mnoma eh lilo mm-hmm. unaweza eh mm-hmm. for me the challenge was accepting that i can do it mm-hmm. and it has been a journey of really accepting that i'm good at this mm-hmm. and this is who i am yeah. and i can do it perfectly mm-hmm. and evo it has been a journey okay. and ndio niweze say kama say nikitoa event ni mc hata uh-huh. nikisema niko na tension which is normal hata yeah. nikiitoa ni mc it's very normal uh-huh. sasa hii niko sure naweza fanya yeah. before yeah. nilikuwa zilika mm-hmm. ah watu wakikai am i sure boy mm-hmm. akimini ninaweza ninajua yeah. as in easy vitu ninaweza handle mm-hmm. that was the challenge mm-hmm. um, highlights Highlight yangu ni funny, ni weird. Mm-hmm. Highlight yangu ilikuwa mamangu kuniona ni KMC. Oh, wow. All through mm-hmm. nilikuwa namwambia mami ni MC. Mami ni mnoma. Mama mama mm-hmm. mamangu alikuwa hakuwahi niona. So this particular day mm-hmm. this was a very uh event yenye unaambianga una unafurahianga sana juu. Mm-hmm. It was my uncle mm-hmm. doing his wedding. Na uncle yangu si mdogo. Okay ni babangu atasifai kumuita anko yeah. ni dad mm-hmm. because ni brother ya babangu mm-hmm. so ni dada ni babangu mdogo yeah. so my dad was doing his wedding mm-hmm. na wamekaa sana na bibi yake yeah. watoto already washa kwa wakubwa mm-hmm. i did it uh, uh, ilikuwa last was it last year yeah i think it was last year mm-hmm. if i'm not wrong si kosho sure. i think last year yeah last year uh, and mom sasa ali hapo ndio the first time aliona ni KMC mm-hmm. and kukuwa na watu wazee waki yeah. wakiku kubalisha ufanye event yao mm-hmm. as an MC si ati mm-hmm. nimeenda ku hype MC yeah. <laughs> it was a blessing so that was my i think for me mm-hmm. that's the highlight for every for all the events that I've done okay yeah so in my intro nilisema we ni radio host mm. eh hey, you, you ilikuja then when did you start <laughs> Mm-hmm. Eh, radio host we okay ilianza last year mhm nishaenda kwa radio tena nikiwa mdogo mm-hmm. but siku pass juu nisikuwa najua kikuyu nilikuwa naitwa mm-hmm. shoro oh, eh mm-hmm. but i kupita juu eh hey, kikuyu sikuwa mm-hmm. nayo mm-hmm. eh but uh, last year yeah. um, around feb mm-hmm. nilipigiwa simu mm-hmm. na mzazi not mzazi someone else alinipigia mm-hmm. akaniambia okay my l- my ear nikianza the beginning of 2022 it was a very mm-hmm. hectic year for me okay. nilikuwa okay. nimerudi ushago mm-hmm. and uh, kwa side ya place yenye nimeoleka sana nilikuwa nimerudi kwa ushago i had decided to start life all together because nilikuwa mm-hmm. nimelose mm-hmm. job yeah. and things were quite tough mm-hmm. uh, for mm-hmm. us mm-hmm. and so mimi nikaamua i thought ah, wacha turudi ushago yeah. uh, mm-hmm just to, yeah. to start life mm. and in the midst of you could start life mm. and just searching and just asking god what do you want yeah. kkk it was a whole lot of things going on emotions going mm-hmm. on and so many things were going on at the same time yeah. nikiwa in the midst of that confusion mm-hmm. nikapigiwa simu mm-hmm. sisi tangu kanipigia simu kanaambia oh kuna mtu anakutafuta mm-hmm. eh, bishti yake alipatana na mtu mm-hmm. akamuonyesha zile vitu mimi ufanya mm-hmm. and they got interested mm-hmm. so nikaambwa kuja by wednesday uko umekuja kuna interview mhm nikatoka you know ni interview ya kufanya nini exactly ah walisema tu wanataka mtu <laughs> sasa I, yeah. nilikuwa najua ni ni mseto yeah ya mambo mseto eh yeah, yeah. but okay haiko inaniingia vyema hiyo <laughs> wakati <laughs> na hata sikuwa najua tita kwa really really red you evil ah nikuwa mm-hmm. tunajua ni mseto okay sikuwa na the whole picture in mind mm-hmm. so nikapigiwa simu nikakuja <coughs> interview on wednesday mm-hmm. na huyo kijana akaniambia friday utapatana na mzazi mm-hmm. eh, friday kafika mm-hmm. eh, nikaenda nikapatana na mzazi tukaongea akaniuliza unataka aliuliza hapo tu maswali mm-hmm. eh, tu maswali tugumu tugumu <laughs> and then akaniambia Aya, uko ready eh mm-hmm. utakuja kesho kwa radio eh mm-hmm. uko sure kwa ready eh kuja kesho saa saba uko hapo umefika hapa yeah hey. <laughs> okay sawa saa saba mimi nikakuwa mm-hmm. so from there kanza mseto how was like that hiyo show ya hiyo siku ya kwanza were you nervous were you just excited hey, i was very nervous <laughs> we nilikuwa so nervous mm-hmm. just saa okay sijaikuwa kwa radio yeah how mm-hmm. where do i even start mm-hmm. so yeye alikuwa anaambia mm-hmm 
uzuri okay yeah. mzazi is i think Giovanni Amekoa in the industry and yeah. just being him mm -hmm. is that person who's able to mm -hmm. teach someone easily. Yeah. And ni mtu mwenye hata ukiwa na yeye kwa show mm -hmm. ni easy ku gel mm -hmm. juu ni easy. Yeah. Na na anajua Kenya anafanya so it's very easy to gel in na yeye. Mm -hmm. And mimi funny enough venye tulifanya na hiyo show mm -hmm. the comments were eh mnaingia na vizuri oh. conversations in a flow. Mm -hmm. I think tuliweza ku ku kuingia na vyema mm. eh yeah. ulikuwa umeambia like maybe your friends and family leo naenda hapo kuna mpenda sasa mbasta waambia ndio kama nikienda ni fail uko like no one hapana finding was not an option yeah so yeah mm. eh, nilikuwa nimewaambia nilikuwa nimeambia wasee by the alafu pia hako ametoka posta hako juni friday saturday yeah. eh aka nilikuwa nimewa show although mm. ni very very intimate people yeah. watu wenye wako karibu na mm -hmm. mimi Yeah. So kufika kwa show mm -hmm. venye alikuwa na aliniambia this is an easy show. Mm -hmm. Isi kama ile ya Monday to Friday. Mm -hmm. Ya Saturday ni ni show ya entertainment tu. Yeah. Ni kama recap ya kila kitu. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what has happened during the week. So mm -hmm. it was a very it's a very easy show. Yeah, yeah. Saturday ni very easy. Mm -hmm. Si easy za Monday to Friday. Mm -hmm. And uh, now that people wanna join like yeah, uko kwa, kwa radio and everything mm. uje pata like wale wasa kujudge mtu akisema like si wewe ni mkorino. Wewe wewe ni Christian. Hiyo hiyo show sio secular. Mama yangu mm -hmm. ni number one mm -hmm. wa kunyami. <laughs> hey, mm -hmm. <coughs> hey, mama yangu mm -hmm. asinichome. <laughs> Aya, anyway. Mm -hmm. But yeah, my mom alikuwa zile za sasa hii show. Ndiyo mm -hmm. ndiyo. Mm -hmm. Toki mera madhake gospel. Unaniambia hivi mama mm -hmm. hii show, hii show yangu. Mm -hmm. Nicho nimepata na hivi mm -hmm. nimeshia inaendanga. Reggae nini? But um hata kukiwa na watu kama hao mm -hmm. for me what I'd really ask them is mm -hmm. tukienda kusoma because I've never studied mass communication yeah, I've yeah. done journalism mm -hmm. in, in campus at when ngi pale tunaandikiwa saa hii ni ya christians hii mm -hmm. ni ya juice ya christians yeah, yeah. ukiwa pale ni job huko mm -hmm. kazi so mm -hmm. ya yeah akuta kwa saa mtu mwenye ataona kama you're not doing the right thing and yeah. it's okay for them to see it that way but for sure. me mm -hmm. uh, i don't see it that way so yeah oh, yeah so like um from that time had this mm -hmm. like what would you say like in call like a highlight kwa you being a radio host um kuna ma events tunendanga za mseto mm -hmm. and there was this particular one that mm -hmm. we did in chuka university mm -hmm. and Iyo nilishukuru mm -hmm. Mungu juu mzazi alichelewa. Hiyo mm -hmm. <laughs> alikuwa anapaswa kukuja mapema bata alichelewa. Hiyo yeah. kuchelewa yake mm -hmm. ilinipea an opportunity mm -hmm. ya ku showcase my talents. Oh, okay. But really mi ku hyper kiss nanga shida. So hizo yeah. events za ku nini za, za ku nikipoa hizo ni ku mm -hmm. I don't have a problem. Mm -hmm. But no hii unafanya ni kama mko radio mm -hmm. na at the same time pia una hype. Yeah, And mm -hmm. venye alichelewa mm -hmm. mimi ndo nilipewa session ya kuanzia. Mm -hmm and for me that was the highlight of it all being able to yeah. like manage mm -hmm. uh mc mm -hmm. kwa, sa kwa such a crowd yeah. yeah okay great so tulisema wewe ni actor mm. una act wapi to be fair to eh eh sasa hii si act popote mm -hmm. but nilikuwa na acting kwa hizi vip Okay zenye nimefanya sana sana ni za kikuyu. Okay. Eh, but kwa act yangu sana 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 mm -hmm. hii on kwa content. Oh, on, on content creation. Because I do yeah. content creation. Yes. Kuna two series tunakuanga nazo mm -hmm. mimi na Celestine. Mhm. Mm Gashohe she yeah. is an actor. Mm -hmm. eh, so yeah, hiyo ndio sasa hii nafanya. Acting mm -hmm. yenye ninafanya pass yenye iko sasa hii mm -hmm. ongoing mm -hmm. ni hizo vitu. Mm -hmm. But um let's see in the future something will come out the future is bright kwa content creation yako in those eh, those small small videos mm. kuna kwanga na hiyo character ya fundi mm. ilitoka wapi hiyo <laughs> so mm -hmm. that's at this day mm -hmm. tumeenda na sister yangu kuchukua nguo yake yeah. oh, anaenda kupimwa nguo mm -hmm. alikuwa na event anaenda kupimwa nguo shonewe yeah. sasa tukiwa tumekaa hapo mm -hmm. Eh, nilikuwa na create content content mm -hmm. but this particular day huu fundi akapigiwa simu yeah anaulizwa mambo ya nguo alikuwa mm -hmm. shoni akaanza to story to story mm -hmm. nikaka nikafikiria by the way ninaweza fanya content ya, ya fundi juma fundi mm -hmm. wanakuanga na kashida mm -hmm. mafundi wanakuanga na kashida yeah. mimi by the way juu kama anyway tutaona kuna mafundi yeah. 
Yeah. Mafundi wenye wanaweza unaweza mpea design hii akutolee hiyo. Mm-hmm. He, ni counted. They are very few. Ama mm-hmm. umwambie nataka nguo this day akupe. Yeah. Mhm. Eh, yani you can count. Mm-hmm. Eh, so ya yeah, nikaanzia hivyo. Nikakuwa fundi wa mafundi. Mm-hmm. Sasa mimi ndio na representing mafundi wote. Uh-huh. Eh, <laughs> wenye vitu on time because kuna hao wengine. Um, okay, no speaking of acting, um, like do you go for auditions? Ama like have you ever gone for auditions like maybe for near theater ama ni just film and everything? Have you gone for auditions? Ama bado. I have. Only, you, obviously. You, have. Men. you can't mm-hmm. kosa because mm-hmm. sauta wapi. Yeah, yeah. And um kwanza kwangu kwa mm-hmm. kuact. Mm-hmm. You know um being an akorino. Mm-hmm. He kuingia acting ni kinda ngumu. Mm-hmm. Juu most times hakuna mtu mwenye anatafuta mkorino kwa oh, okay mm-hmm. ni kama zote. Hakuna mtu anakuanga kitafuta mkorino mm-hmm. atingia kwa character. Yeah. Unless ni hizi za comedy ndio zao kwa na eh hizi serious mimi sijaona mm-hmm. serious ni kwa na mkorino kwa yeah, kweli I've seen like hizo like they work call for auditions like on a specify you want to be between hey. this and this aimbe aimbe like this hey. never like a character imetengenezwa we want them to be a corino hakuna yeah. hakuna hata mm-hmm. moja labda ianzie hakuna enyeshe kushai kwa na muislamu mimi sijaona mkorino oh yeah, true yeah hakuna labda mm-hmm. waanzie mm-hmm. but mm-hmm. so for me it was a very hard uh, a thing yeah. kwangu mm-hmm. because i i love acting mm-hmm. and sasa hiyo kukubali ni zaenda nitoe kitambaa na nifanye mm-hmm. juu sasa unajua kenda kwa act si wewe ambe yeah, ni mtu mwingine it's, it's another character, character. Yeah. Uh, it, it was a very tough decision for me mm-hmm. so with time niki grow up mm-hmm. with time ndo nimekuja mm-hmm. nikiona i can still do it yeah. i can still go for auditions without the tabanju hata nikifika hapo na kitambaa obviously nita Sio tu zile auditions na nikaambua we know you are a good actor but oh, character au ko atuna hiyo jo kwa mind yao nikitokea na kitambo obviously I want to expect nitatoa nani ata expect tutatoa no plus there is that judgment your first impression eh. nitasha tukuana so zenye mm-hmm. nime gain confidence mm-hmm. na si kitambo <laughs> hivi juzi juzi uh-huh. nimeenda bila mm-hmm. kitamba mm-hmm. so yeah so atakuja ku realize baadaye na by the way yeah, ana 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 kuanga mkorino hiyo eh which is not a good thing because i don't think anyone should be judged by their appearance at least ngoja mtu afanye whatever meme later happen they know you can judge them based on what they've done um, and also based on your requirements you know the It's problem perfect. is yeah. apana, the problem is mm-hmm. this is the character that we want mm-hmm. si ndio mm-hmm. so ukikuja kama mkorino honestly hata nikitaka kutoka ku judge mm-hmm. no but nasema nase in terms of like unaona kama vile some maybe character imewekwa wamesema mm, mm. <coughs> like they want someone who same way see you dance mm. like they want someone who can dance between this and this age like na kwa this height mm. you see those are things that you can do yeah. but now the moment and your talent will speak for itself but now the moment you umeshakuja tu hivi hata before mtakupatia chance ya kuona kama you can truly dance mm. na umemitizo qualifications zako like ah eh, already kwanza ni mkorino but i understand <coughs> sorry but i understand ni penye tu uko na pia the exposure ya watu wengi there's already this judgment kama nyo ulikuwa unasema when you started mtu ako like hey ana hype na ni mkorino <coughs> na ni msichana which you see you're already judging someone na uh, hiyo it yes it is part of you because it is your faith mm. but it is not your entire nini like there are so many things that mm. you can do but i understand hapo kwa <coughs> there is also the character and everything that yeah. they want but imagine but when yeah. you get to when you <coughs> get into the industry mm-hmm. una hizo yeah. hata uonange watu wanakujudge yeah it's just you don't see it mm-hmm. unazanga ku understand yeah, why yeah. they are mm-hmm. they are this way why it is very strict mm-hmm. juka say it's yeah. for example let's let's speak a show mm-hmm. enyi na ina run sa hii yeah. tuseme kama hii juka inaitwa Dora ama sijui nini kuna show ina run mm-hmm. ya kina Brenda Wairimu na uh, ine, Zora si Zora Zora ni ya Brenda Wairimu mm-hmm. na Hassan. Sarah Hassan eh. yeah So mtu ana, wanataka msichana mweupe mwenye mm. akona hivi nywele mm-hmm. anatoshana hivi yeah. lazima wakaini wa, wa mm. kawa na then mm. umetokea na kitamba hata ikiwa atanaanguka chini kuna zingine yenyewe shauri hata hivi ukishaona tu the requirement kwa like uh, you yeah. know the, the is no way like, so when you yeah. understand the criteria that ha- goes on mm-hmm. pia wewe sasa unaanza you don't look at them as if they are judging you yeah, yeah. so when do unaanza kujua okay what can mm-hmm. i do yeah, yeah. So um ushaikuwa na like an embarrassing moment in 
hyping and seeing basically in your career. Mm-hmm. <coughs> <Nah>. <coughs> Honestly, so far, <coughs> nah. Nah. Mm, that one have been different. Okay, good. embarrassing. Mm-hmm. No, no. Sioni ata moja. Juata zeni nili nilienda kwa kuna road show nili ito. Yeah. I have d- never done it any kind of road show. Mm-hmm. I didn't know what to say. Yeah. Nilipigia tu simu nikolzwa karimo mm-hmm. kwa available when kwa available mm-hmm. kuna nini inaitike eh sijui karere yeah. njama ilikuwa ni ya kiamba. Mhm. Wanataka MC kuna Loriko haina yeah. MC. Unaweza eh najua hata na fan niseme nini? Mm-hmm. Najua hata ni nitaanzia aje. Yeah. Nikafika. So kufika niliuliza tu mse okay nafaa kusema. Mhm. Ah, ndio tulikuwa na. Kwa kosa na umeitwa wa kazi. Hata wewe tuliko na kwa mtoto. So unafani semeni yake na mbona ukifika ndakwambia nikifika nilikuta yeah. lori yake ilishaenda. So wenye oh. tuko na ndo alikuwa na ni guide. Yeah. And then venye nilishika mic mm-hmm. by God's grace mimi yeah, nakwanga na sauti yenye. Nikiongea unasikia. Yeah, utasikia. Kwa wema wa Mungu. <laughs> So yeah. bila nishika mic mm-hmm. niko zile za ne mm-hmm. ntramo ke the mondo ado mm-hmm. ah oh ilikuwa ya kikuyu eh, ni kikuyu hey, okay. so nikamwambia ni kana tena tu abota mondo ngeto karere njama nilisema tu hivyo ocha lini alikomen kasirikia ni melete alikuwa amekaa mbele ya truck alikuja nyuma yeye ndiye ananiambia hapo panaitwa hivi tangaza hapo panaitwa hivi tangaza tumeenda pale salimia fulani wa fulani juu ya nikishika mic but mm-hmm. i don't i honestly mm-hmm. I, i have not had any embarrassing yeah. moment yeah. Yeah. okay so uh, as a woman and also in the industry like event and seeing and everything what is the impact do you hope like kazi yako it may come how would you want your work to inspire other women young girls when you want aspire to work in the industry this is what mm-hmm. i i i have kwa hati yangu yeah. and it's very dear to me mm-hmm. it's um i i hope and pray that mm-hmm. through the talent that god has given me yeah. i'll be able to impact other young girls mm-hmm. who are confined in religious mm-hmm. uh, sectors yeah. tradi- uh, cultural uh, Yaani wale watoto wenye wanajipata wako kwa culture enye haye wala unaambwa you can't do this because yeah. you're in this culture mm-hmm. you can't do this because you're in this faith mm-hmm. you can't do this because you're an akorino yeah. you can't do this because you're a masai mm-hmm. you can't do this because you're a muslim mm-hmm. as in i want to change that narrative yeah. because when god gifts us mm-hmm. hakuangi amesema hii ni amukorino hii ni yeah. asijui masai mm-hmm. hii ni mzungu yeah. isijui ni asijui mm-hmm. mkisi mm-hmm. watu 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 wa apana i just my prayer is mm-hmm. to change that narrative mm-hmm. that i can't do this just because mm-hmm. i come from this place yeah okay so now what would be like your advice for people when you're like now the ondo wanaanza sasa ndo mtu ameanza ku mc ni what would be your advice for them based on your experience now so this is what i can tell someone that is starting up you need to be very confident of mm-hmm. who you are yeah. and the gift that god has given you mm-hmm. If you know that you're good at emceeing, yeah. It needs to start from within. Mm-hmm. Be confident. Mm-hmm. I am good. Mm-hmm. I can do it. Mm-hmm. I am able to. Mm-hmm. Then from there, anza ku research mm-hmm. what are other what are other people doing? Mm-hmm. Unaona, mm-hmm. we are not all knowing mm-hmm. what can I do? Mm-hmm. How can I improve? Mm-hmm. What can I add? Mm-hmm. Nikienda event, mimi nikifanya events hadi saa hii. Mm-hmm. Like last Saturday I had an event ya Rafiki. Mm-hmm to a small birthday yeah. but at after nimefanya na ni ile ni rafiki yangu yeah. and mm-hmm. i make sure that whatever event that you're given mm-hmm. hata kama ni ya kazini yako hata kama ni ya sister yako mm-hmm. you give your 100% yeah. yeah. you, utaangalia tie ni dadangu dadangu sasa yeah. sianeza ni rehemu hata ni sipo mm-hmm. nikianda perform apana yeah. it doesn't matter who has given you the job mm-hmm. make sure you give your 100% yeah. and after umefanya hiyo job mimi naulizanga nilifanya aje mm-hmm. Was it good? Yeah. Was it so that mm-hmm. for the next event I can improve. Nikimalizia hapo nauliza nga okay what can I add? Kama sasa mimi nakuanga na shida ya kuwa na mastori mastori uko kwa niki MC. So unajua ma MC wengi wanakuanga na pia na story. So that is something that I'm learning. Ndio hata nikienda kwa events I can add something new. Ndio I I continue learning, I continue learning. Yes. Ah yes, so ulikuwa mention earlier that um, yote mimi ulikuwa umeenda ushago and everything it was a friend who called you who called you like a friend aka call sister aka like yani it is someone mm. who referred you to 
to like the role and everything and also vile umekuja kwa studio umekuja na your audience like your audience wewe ulikuja na mashabiki wako how what do you think is the impact of having family and friends who mm. who support you and who refer you mm. let me tell you mm-hmm. there's nothing yeah. that is a blessing kama hiyo mm-hmm. because let me tell you these people yeah. will help you grow mm-hmm. if you have true friends yeah. and true family people that are mm-hmm. supporting you mm-hmm. and they are always cheering you on like mm-hmm. kama mimi mali nimefika nimefika yeah. because of family mm-hmm. and friends yeah. uh, like the last event that i did and yeah imekuwa na so many comments on tiktok yeah. because of the way i had won hiyo mm-hmm. uh, ilitokana na mtu nilikuwa na university mm-hmm. akani refer yeah na yeye alinirefer mm-hmm. jo aliona harusi ya sister yangu uh-huh. nilikuwa nime hype yeah. trend mm-hmm. so kama sister yangu hange ni support ni hype yeah. harusi yake jo unajua mm-hmm. si lazima anipe yeah, si lazima yeah. alikuwa na mc yeah. Alikuwa mm-hmm. na MC wake mm-hmm. angesema MC aende 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 yeah, but yeah. kama sister yangu hange shikilia zile za mm-hmm. lazima uta hype lilo yeah. if i didn't get that support mm-hmm. singepata hii harusi na singepata vitu zingine yeah. zenye zimekuja yeah. after harusi yake okay. so mm-hmm. for me mm-hmm. the support that comes from my family mm-hmm. i can never trade it with anything Okay so what does the future look like for you? Eh ni nini unataka ku accomplish maybe in the next few years ama something that you're already working on ama like what is your dream to kiong before we started the show ni sema haujafika bado kwa hii safari. Eh ni wapi hapo unataka kufika? We 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 like I'm so mm-hmm. okay nikiangalia I feel like I'm yeah. far from mm-hmm. what I want to achieve mm-hmm. because si nimekwambia niko na a very dear niko na kitu dia kwangu kwa roho yangu ya to support mm-hmm. these young girls yes, that are growing yes. up yeah. when you are kwa mm-hmm. places in you are confined into yeah. situations where they think maybe i can do this by the way acha nikwambie sisi kama hatungeanza ku dance wakurino wengi wange kwa wana dance yeah because when you started hakuna Haku wana dance yeah. we were the first yeah. dancing crew in akorea na mkajita kwenye revolution <laughs> tulikuwa <laughs> tunajita na atukona atuko si atuje atuko tuweka <laughs> kama jita revolutionist dance uh, but uh, ilianzia na brother zangu alikuwa mm, anajita mm, gospel spinners yeah. then sasa venye mimi niliekwa ikajita revolutionist mm-hmm, dancers mm-hmm. and kama hatungekuwa na hiyo yeah. hatungefanya hiyo kitu so many mm-hmm. things hazingetokana na hiyo yeah. and sasa hivi unaona watu wana mm-hmm. dance mm-hmm. watu wa mama wana dance vitu yeah. zenye zilikuwa so ni kama ni bad men kwa yes. kanisa yeah. Yeah so mm-hmm. I have a dream of um, uh, nurturing such talents and mm-hmm. having a center mm-hmm. where different talents can come mm-hmm. what one is a come now there different talents then you mean you mostly involved in mm-hmm. and or grow Okay great yeah. so Kuna kitu watu jasema ungetaka kusema As we come to the end of the show um, what will be your parting shot and also tell people where they can find you or your social media handles your number anything if someone wants to contract your services mm. ama unataka mm. collab here content creations it's good to collaborate and everything eh yeah. mtu ako na movie uko na kipindi na ungetaka mtu akuje ku act yeah <laughs> where can they find you so yeah, this is what i can tell people that eh, kwa kila kitu yenye unafanya mhm maudu mare mo the mood we wika yeah uwe kira gai e bere mm-hmm. make sure that you involve god because Gaire no heaga no to hete iheo ishi tu na shio yeah. and Mungu ndiye ametufikisha mahali tuko mm-hmm. sahi mm-hmm. if it were not for god hata hizi vitu zote tunafanya no to yeah. ni maudu mm-hmm. mato mm-hmm. so kwa kila kitu yenye unafanya make sure mm-hmm. that you involve god in it mm-hmm. make sure that you start with god make mm-hmm. sure that it is god that is ndio mwanzilishi wa hiyo kitu yeah. so yeah if you want mm-hmm. me for your events by the way you let a hype Woo! <laughs> Easy <laughs> chocha. Mm-hmm. Me will let a hype. I'm mm-hmm. very good at what I do. Unaenda pale Instagram eh uangalie Lilo Karema L Y L O W K A R I M A ama uende Facebook uh, ama uende TikTok. Uko kote ni Lilo Karema. Mm-hmm. You can DM me ama pia unaweza nipata through my email that is karemacreatives@gmail.com. Unaweza ni DM ama untumie email karimacreatives@gmail.com. Mm-hmm. Number, mm-hmm. number number ni, 
nitawapea siku nyingine nikipata ya ofisi <laughs> just um, my personal yeah, number so okay. yeah, that is why we are using mm-hmm. the email so mm-hmm. unaenda tu kwa email karema creatives at gmail.com mm-hmm. ama unazani dm instagram facebook ama mm-hmm. tiktok Okay thank you so much Kari. for coming and for sharing your, your journey na pia ku encourage wase hivyo vile umesema ya people wako kon mtu ana feel siwezi fanya kitu fulani mm. juu ya vitu juu ya circumstances around them mm. and we can do it all so yes. thank you for sharing your journey and wish you all the best with the center thank you ukikuja ku launch hivi utuambie i will i will we truly wish you all the best and thank you for coming asante Thank you so much guys for watching and I hope that you've learned something. I hope that you've been inspired to not let your circumstances or your background limit you from doing what you want to do and from actualizing your dreams. Uh, just a reminder that our episode was sponsored by Cool Palace Airbnb. Their offices are located at Muthaiga Square First Floor Wing C. They have studio apartments, one bedroom and two bedroom apartments. Uh, their homes are located along Kiambu Road. Tikaro da Tresambu at Ruaka and in Sosiani Estate. You can call them on the numbers on your screen to book your stay. Thank you and until the next episode, bye.